It's the only thing you should know That I'm here to stay with you Hi everyone and welcome back to Style by Zaza. Now I'm sure you've noticed that my hair is on the wild side. I love this look. It has that beachy wavy look. It's fun, it's sassy, it's easy, and it took me maybe about 15 or 20 minutes to get this look. All you need is a hair waver tool that has either a large or a jumbo barrel, like this one by Golden Hut. This is a great tool. I have tested a lot of tools, and this one by far works the best for my hair type, because one, I have a lot of hair, which I'm sure you've noticed, and I have thick hair. I purchased this at Sally's Beauty Supply Store for about $45 and hair waiver tools run anywhere from $20 to maybe about $150 to $200 but this one really does a great job. It locks in the waves and keeps my waves nice and shiny as you can see. So yeah, this one is the one for me. This waiver creates large beachy waves. It has cool tips for easy handling and three jumbo ceramic barrels. I love that it has an adjustable temperature control ranging from 200 to 450 degrees. So it's perfect for any hair type. And for my thick hair, I set the temperature to 400 degrees. It has a locking ring for convenient storage and a tangle free swivel cord. So let's get started. Always use Hair Waver on dry hair. Start from the back and work your way up. Take a small section from the bottom and clip the remainder of your hair to keep it away while you wave each section. Apply heat protection serum and or heat protection spray. I'm using one of my favorites, Silk Elements Heat Protection Spray and this can be purchased at Sally Beauty Supply Store. I use two to three pumps for each section and I prefer to apply this product with my hands versus spraying it directly onto my hair so it won't weigh my hair down. Use a comb to evenly distribute the product and to get rid of any tangles. Work from the roots to the end of hair. Take about a two inch section of hair or use enough width to match the size of your waver barrels and place between the barrels approximately half an inch to an inch away from the roots. Clamp down and hold waver in position anywhere from 5 to 10 seconds depending on the condition of your hair. Gently release the clamp and continue down the section by matching the outermost wave of the hair with the barrels. And again clamp and hold waver for a few seconds. As you can see, this waver creates beautiful S-shaped waves. Repeat steps with the remaining sections of your hair. And when I'm done, I use a flat iron on top to smooth out any hard lines created by the waver. I take small sections and flat iron one to two inches from the roots. Run your fingers through your hair to separate the waves. And don't use a brush through the waves because using a brush can flatten the waves. 
Now if you want a fuller look, tease a small section from the back. Apply a small amount of shine serum or spray with your hands to create a beautiful shiny look. I like to use Silk Infusion by Chi, which can also be used as a heat protectant. And you can buy it at your local drugstore or beauty supply store. For longer lasting waves, use Hairspray. I love this one by L'Oreal. It's the Elnet Satin Hairspray. You can also buy this at your local drugstore or beauty supply store. And that's it. See how pretty these waves are? And if this is your first time using a hair waver tool, be patient and keep practicing. You will be able to style your hair in no time. Now I style my hair this way once in a while. And I don't recommend using the hair waver on a daily basis because it can damage your hair even if you use heat protectants. So if you want to use it once in a while, I say go for it. And the shoe of the day from my personal collection is by Betsy Johnson. These are absolutely stunning green suede shoes. They're beautiful, double bow, pointy toe, not so high heel, and they look very comfortable. I bought these about four days ago from Marshalls. I love to go to Marshalls, one of my favorite places to shop. This is Remix, R-E-M as in Mary, I-X-X, Betsy Johnson. I love the gold heart in the back. Beautiful, beautiful shoe. I tried to find these online, but I could not find them anywhere. So I guess you're just gonna have to go to Marshalls, like fairly soon and um, hopefully they have them in stock. So good luck and I hope you enjoy the shoe of the day. Thank you so much for watching and also please don't forget to subscribe and if you'd like to comment below that would be great. You can also find me on Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram and Twitter. Thank you so much again, and I will see you soon. Have a fabulous day. Take care. Bye-bye. I really like it a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Isn't this cool, funny, funny, funky? This is so, so, so super easy. We love this look because it's just so, oh, why can't I get this done? With not even, not even, not even. This. This was not done in the room. <laughs> I have a lot of hair and ah, yeah, yeah. But I love their styles because you never know what to, you know. <laughs> you can hurt someone with this.